Monday, Craig Warwick here and I hope you're all having a lovely holiday season. For me, it's the end of July 2016, but that music that was over the intro there must mean it's time for another of my Secret Santa custom projects. This is the fifth year that I've taken part in this and you can check out my other attempts on my YouTube channel. The first year I made Ghost, then I made Dormammu, then I made Shredder. Last time I made Apocalypse and I don't know who I'm going to make this time. That's what we're going to find out in this video. So to explain this, if this is your first time joining me, Wes Wright, a fellow customizer, organizes this event over at the forums on thefoosh.com. Wes invites customizers from around the globe to sign up and join in on this event, and each customizer makes up a wish list of customs they would like to receive from another customizer. Wes then gathers all those lists, mixes them around, and sends them out to all the different customizers and we each pick one person from the list to make for another secret person. Then all us customizers start making figures for each other and we'll hopefully get them all out in time for Christmas and everyone can get a unique original custom figure. So I've sent out my list and that's gone to some customizer somewhere. I don't know who, I don't know where, but I've got a list in return and I'm gonna look at that right now and you can see my initial reaction and thoughts on who I'm going to make from that list. I don't know who the list is from, but hopefully they won't be horrified when it comes Christmas and they get a custom from me. So I've got the list here on my tablet, just going to read them out one by one. Let's get going. It's a very short list. I've got John Marston from Red Dead Redemption, Old Man Logan, Pennywise from Stephen King's It, John Lynch from Teen 7, Backlash, Tank Girl, Shipwreck, Colorado Kid and Bucky O'Hare and that's the end of the list. Initial thoughts are oh my god no. Um yeah let me see I normally go for Marvel guys so out of this list who have we got there? Um Old Man Logan. God the Wolverine oh no. But okay, let's just go down the list again. John Marston from Red Dead Redemption. Um, yeah, I really, really liked the game and actually my husband is, was a playtester on the game, so there you go. Um, what can I say about it? I don't know. Cowboy guy? Uh, maybe the zombie version though. It doesn't specify. Mm. So yeah, Old Man Logan. Um, really enjoy that story. Um, don't know again. Oh, oh god, I'm coming up blanks here. Pennywise, Stephen King's It. I do love It and um, of course Tim Curry as Pennywise is great. Um, but thinking about that as a figure, you know he has those very voluminous um, sleeves and legs don't uh, sort of lend themselves well to sculpting so I'd need to do a lot of work with fabric or stuff. Um, and again, it's making a likeness of an actual physical person. Difficult, difficult. John Lynch from Team 7, I, I don't know who that is. I'll have to go away and look at it. Someone here called Backlash. Again, I'm sure there's lots of characters in fiction called Backlash. I know Blacklash, the Iron Man villain, um, but Backlash? I'm not sure who that is. Might have to ask Wes if he can clarify who that is. Tank Girl, of course, um, famous indie comic. Never been a fan, no. And someone made quite an awesome custom of her a couple of years back. So, not sure I'll go down that route. Shipwreck. Now, Shipwreck is that. He's from G.I. Joe. He's like the, the Navy guy. The Colorado Kid from Cowboys of the Moo Mesa. Never heard of it. Don't know. We'll have to look that up. I'm imagining it's some kind of cow cowboy. Don't know. And Bucky O'Hare. He goes where no ordinary rabbit would dare. I know Bucky O'Hare. Um, God, n absolutely nothing is jumping out <laughs> God, what have I let myself in for? Um, but whoever has uh, submitted this list, um, hopefully you're watching this. And uh, fuck you. It's it's very it's very macho this list isn't it, don't you think? Very lone wanderer 
especially that green rabbit at the end. Um, okay, well there we have it. So I'll mull this over, seek some clarification on a couple of items, and um, hopefully in the next episode I'll have come up with something or killed myself. So if there is only part one and there is no further part two, then well thanks for watching and Merry Christmas. Bye. No. I'll see you tomorrow or in the next episode if I have to really squeeze them all in quickly. Bye. Mm -hmm.